Hello everybody and welcome back to some Dead by Daylight. Now, while we play, because uh, I've got to address some stuff and I've got to explain what went on when I wasn't, you know, playing or anything. Uh, do I don't want to do Claudette build today. Sorry, I haven't sorted any of this out. I just kind of threw on the game. Uh, wait, are the, the cakes still, like, offerable or... You know, I'm, I'm gonna go back to Dwight. I, I've been upgrading characters just because, you know, sacrificial cakes, because they're kind of good XP and all that. And I don't have any with Dwight, but... Uh, do I want to use Dwight? Uh, I kind of... I'm contemplating, contemplating, uh... What are the benefits? I don't know. <laughs> uh... And we'll just go with it. I don't care. I don't need to put on an offering. But I, I want to, like, explain everything that went on in the time that I was, unfortunately, off. So, what happened was that the laptop had 196 gigabytes of, of uh, videos on it. But I was very confused because I deleted everything. And people were like, are you sure you deleted everything? I was 100% sure. It's only when we were getting, when we were going through all the files and we were getting all checked out that I saw something called Wondershare. Because I, I think that the program I run is uh, Wonder Filmora and uh, Wonder Filmora 9. And it, it made another file called Wondershare. And I looked at that and I'm like, I don't think my dad installed that. Because the, the, the laptop that he has is from his workplace and... It came down with water damage, but he fixed it, so it was free. So he kind of just took it and was like, yeah, you can have this. You can use it for recording. So I was like, okay, cool. Because it's absolutely, it's absolutely perfect now. Like, it's, it was in a really bad condition, but my dad fixed it. So, you know, mine. And this wasn't me just saying dibs. He was like, hey, you can use this for YouTubing. So I was like, thanks. But, yeah, he, he uh, installed, like, a bunch of AVGs. So I was like, that doesn't sound, you know, correct. And basically, whenever the videos got, like, uploaded to YouTube, it put them in that file for some stupid reason. Which means, whenever I thought I was deleting a video from just regular videos, it wasn't deleting it. It was, del it was deleting the idea of it. But when the video would be deleted, let's say the storage from it, the storage that it would take up. So if a video took 9 gigs, basically, the video would be gone, but the 9 gigs would stay because it would be in that file. So I didn't know that. And that's what happened. So that was the whole problem that was going on because I didn't know that. And then when we figured out 196 gigs was like freed up. So I was like, okay, that, that's a lot. That's a lot more room. <laughs> and also, uh, before that, uh, which kind of ties into the story, I was going to upload another series. This was back when my, before my sister came and I mentioned that like 10, 12 videos back. That she was coming, and I was like, oh, I want to do, like, a lot of things, and I didn't get a lot of videos done. And I had a project because she liked the series, but I didn't get a chance. To, I, well, I, I was trying to upload it. I didn't get a chance to upload it, but I was trying to, and it didn't work, and I got angry. And I kid you not, 25 times trying to, to upload it. Because if you want the actual, like, numbers, it was 25, altogether it was 25 attempts. But attempts that failed were probably... We're looking at the ballpark of probably 13, but attempts that like worked but didn't fully like complete, we're looking at about 12. And these uploads on Filmora, uh, I call it Filmora because for short, even though it's Filmora, but the uploads on Filmora are not like quick. They're not like, oh, 10 seconds. They're half an hour to an hour, sometimes an hour and a half. So the video I had was an hour long, which means I was taking an hour IRL time, an hour to an hour and a half. And it got to 50% and it would just not work. So I'm probably, I'm going to re-upload it, but I'll tell you what the video was in a second. But I'm going to re-upload it and I'll do it as a short time span and maybe it'll work. But basically, 50% uh, of Filmora's upload time is your actual video. Is your actual video. The, re the other 50 is processing. Like, processing to put it on the platform you're doing on whether it be youtube instagram snapchat twitter facebook doesn't matter the other 50 percent is that 
and it would do the 50% of my video, like going like, oh yeah, this is the video, we've scanned it, but it wouldn't upload it. And it, it wasn't like, oh, I swear or anything, like, I, you've seen the Dead by Daylight videos, they're worse, I barely swear. But, uh, basically, the video was Legend of Zelda, because she said she wanted me to play Dead by Daylight and Legend of Zelda, and my uncle wanted me to do it as well. So I was like, okay, I've got requests for that. I basically tried to do it, and as I said, 25 times, uh, 20, uh, not 20, uh, 12 of those were actual, like, it uploaded to 50, and then just knotted. It, uh, like, I refreshed it, and I reclosed the software, I restarted the computer, just wouldn't work, so I'm gonna have to redo it. But, it, there were funny jokes, but it flopped, because, 50, uh, halfway through, because I wasn't paying attention to the laptop, because my sister was coming over and, like, an hour or two, so and the video was an hour, so you can imagine my rush. But basically, uh, it froze halfway through. Like it was still working, but like it was skipping. Like it, my audio quality was fine. It was just the actual video was screwed up. But like I did like the first like two shrines, I think. No, I I summoned the tower and I got the shrine. I got one of the shrines done. So when I do it again, I will cut it down. Well, I'll do only half an hour, and then I'll do a lot of it off screen. That is important stuff like getting materials and like stuff. But I had a I had a couple awesome plays. Like there's a battle that I did early on, and I'll do it again. But basically, I had no weapons. I had only a couple sticks, and I beat like three of the go the beginning red goblin guys. And I was so impressed with myself. Because basically, I killed one of them, it fell off the- the weapon fell off the edge, and I was like, oh my god, I'm so stupid. Then I killed the second one, and this is not my build, so I- uh, I killed the second one, and then I got his weapon as my last weapon broke. Nope, gotta leave. As my la- Oh, okay, okay, that's a demigorgon. I think that's a demigorgon. Hex, uh, the sir the third seal. What is that? Oh, oh no. What a what are you? Oh, it's the hag. Okay. Yeah, so she can play place curse marks, but yeah, things when things hit the fan and I'll do I'll do it again and I'll you know. Yeah, hag curse marks. But yeah, I'll I'll do it again and everything. Uh okay. Uh those curse marks mean that if if someone comes over and they walk into that, basically the hag will appear, and she can either turn into that body, or she can, uh, or they'll just, you know, be in the way. But they're a real nuisance, because they flip your camera. So if you're looking towards me, and if one was right in front of me, it would turn you around. So you have to turn your camera. Uh, we got one person. Was that a quick fall? See, like that. And now she's hit. Also, and what I meant by this is not my build is be okay. Gotta run. This is not my build because my build, as you've seen from if you go back in the last two videos, is a different build. But me, uh, my sister, and my cousin would. Oh no, he. I'm. The tunneling. The tunneling. The tunneling. No, no, stop it. Okay, uh, I'll explain what tunneling is first, and then I'll get into why my 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 perks are different. Uh, tunneling is when the person, the killer, just goes after one person the whole game. And as you can see, I'm the only one on a hook, and I'm going on my second hook. So, that's tunneling. I've been tunneled. Also, I think a bit of camping, I think? Hags are known for that, so it's kind of a jerk, jerk move. I'm still gonna, you know, struggle. Because either I'll get freed, or I'll get, get blood points. But, yeah, me... Me, my sister, and my cousin decided, hey, because my, my, my cousin, Doubtless, wasn't there. Because, the, as, damn it, as I mentioned, the, the two cousins I played Dead by Daylight with, they, oh, oh yeah, see, she summoned into that body. My two cousins that play Dead by Daylight with me, uh, basically, English, if I can, I got a lot of things are happening. <laughs> Basically, the the brother and sister. So there's Doubtless and Little Jimmy. Little Jimmy is actually a girl. So it was it was Little Jimmy and my sister and me. And I came up with the idea: what if we do different perks? So I it would be like, uh, I will, I'll kind of go through what it was because there's not many people. The totem. Oh, sh nope. She's gonna teleport into that body and it's gonna kill me. 
The totems mean they have a they have a, a hex going on. So even if I die, I've broken the lit totem. Please don't be a hundred grams. That was good. That was good. But she knows why I'm I am. So the top quirk perk I have, the one that keeps kind of blinking on and off, is called spine chill. Spine chill means she's looking in my direction, which is pretty handy if you don't know uh, like about this game. Like if you're like, oh, I need to know where the killer is if they're looking at me in a certain direction. If they're looking at you, spine chill goes off. So best perk to have as a beginner. But basically, there are f uh, in the, in the row. There's five. So I would go. I've got four rows of perks and a small bit of the fifth. So I say I only have two on the fifth, and then I go to my customer and say pick one like randomly, and she'd pick one, and then I go to my sister. She she'd pick one for me, and then I go back to uh, back to her, and then back to my sister, and that would be my row. And then we did it for all of us. So sometimes we got really good ones. Like I got kind of banger ones. Like I got adrenaline. I got no, no. I never got adrenaline. I got I got bond, which is one that I run all the time, and I got proved myself in the same build. So I was, I was real happy. But I'm trying to find gems. But uh, yeah, I remember my sister got she got uh what was it uh David King's perk, which is like supposed to be the speed perk. She got adrenaline and she got something else. And she was like, oh, this is terrible. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hey, I healed myself. I can tank another hit. Try it again. Hey, I, I may be dead, but we've got all the totems. There's only five totems. And if you see next to the totem icon on my, my screen, there's a five there. So we got all of them. All of them were gotten. Man's gonna die, but man doesn't care. Because you only hooked really, pretty much me. But yeah, I'm just gonna be doing you know two rounds and you know get it done. Now if round if I flop then I flop. But you know that's the game. But basically like a lot like all that was going on. <sighs> I, I'm I'm really sad that I didn't get to upload that Legend of Zelda. It was banger. I liked it. Like obviously it was a bit corny at points. Like it was kind of bad. And it will have the 14 plus warning because, you know, it's not completely user friendly, but eh, it's good enough. So, I don't remember what the hag's abilities are. Well, I, I know it's a teleport thing, but I think that's it because I know the nurse is, if you heal, she can have a perk called Nurse's Calling, which is what sometimes hags like to run. Because if, if, you, if you go against a hag, they will almost always have perks, so have small game on. Does someone have kindred? Oh, these two. Uh, this one and the, the one on the hook. You see the little eye one? That's called kindred. It means you can see the killer from a certain radius. So kindred is quite handy to have. So if you have one person running kindred in like a group chat, like if you're in like a group of like four, have one person at least running Kindred. Because I usually run Bond, so I can see everyone and I can know if I'm being chased, which I usually do. I actually don't opt to get chased, I just get chased. But when I get chased, my usual thing is have Bond on, so if someone, if two people are on the generator, I don't run into them, or I can curve, curve myself around and mold myself so I don't go into people with gens, or doing totems, or getting a chest, or, or, or be near a killer shack where someone's doing a gen inside. Usually, I'll, I'll give you a little hint, like, sorry, I have to. But, yeah, I don't usually do it. Oh, they placed a marking right there, in front. What a jerk. <laughs> uh, woman's blind. <laughs> oh, they even par I didn't even know they trapped it there. Oh, they know, they know. Oh, they- Oh, they are such a jerk. They trapped everywhere. Look, listen. At this not look, listen, but listen. At this point, they're either gonna get the generators and one of them's gonna get out, or they're not gonna get the generators and the hatch is gonna spawn. Cause the hatch uh, usually spawns when two people are left. And I'm telling you like I'm smart, but I didn't know this for a while, cause I've played for about a year. But basically, uh, yeah. 
the hatch will spawn at two, but it won't open up unless you have a key. It won't open up until there's one person left. Oh, they're screwed. I, I, good on Dwight, not Dwight, good on the bill for like at least banging the generator out. Uh, I know it's an epic chasing, but oh yeah, they're doing nothing. This is epic. Um, <laughs> I like the name. Um. <laughs> Oh, that at least banging out a generator. Nice. Oh, the bill has self-care and empathy and I believe unbreakable and left behind. I think that's all of his things. The reason I know this is because my sister play. So first off, this my sister plays Bill and has been playing him for the last like two, three months. So we know he has empathy, uh, uh, empathy, unbreakable, and no, it's not empathy. It's unbreakable. Left behind and borrow time. Unbreakable means if you're on the floor, you can get up. Left behind, I don't remember what left behind is, but I know borrow time is where if you unhook someone, they won't get it. If they get hit, they won't die for like, let's say, 10 to, 10 to 15 seconds. So whenever my sister unhooks me, she goes, You have borrow time. Or if she's unhooking someone else, she's like, You have borrow time, go. I'll protect you. Which is actually very sweet. If, if she watches this, because. She wants to, because uh, I'll be honest. She was like, you know how you upload in bulk? Don't do that. Upload daily. So, I'm hoping I can get a video out for Thursday, because Thursday I'm going to be going to a bit of an appointment, and I'll take it most of the day. But if I can get back, or if I can record on Wednesday, if I can record like a, a couple of videos, then boom. Because I have, because I'm recording this quite late. I'm I have work tomorrow, and I have... Yeah, I have work tomorrow, and then I have work on Friday, so today today would be the Tuesday night, and work on Wednesday, which is tomorrow, and Friday. Which is actually not bad, because we're having a barbecue. And if you're like, oh, who are you having the barbecue with? Uh, I'm having it with my cousins, uh, on my, my father's side. And I'm having it with my sister, well, almost all my sisters. Unfortunately, one of them is doing nursing, and she, she couldn't get a day off, because... At the at because she's third year, if I'm correct, third or fourth, which means she's finishing up this year, and it means that if she wanted to take one day off, she'd have to take two weeks off, which means she'd miss a lot because I think she said she was going to a new ward, or it's just a hassle because they have a buddy system going on where if one person takes a two, if one person takes two weeks off, the other person, if even if they don't want to, has to take that two weeks off. So I think my sister doesn't want to do it for them. Because, you know, it'd be a hassle to catch back up then. Which, I respect her. But it's also a, a jerk move by the hospital. Even though I go, I actually go to that hospital. But it's kind of a jerk move because it's also her birthday. Which is why we're having the party. Because my two sisters didn't get to have their, their birthday parties or anything because of COVID. And mine's coming up. And uh, I've mentioned this once before. But our birthdays are in line with our ages. So... Because I, I usually don't remember that ages that well, but like, usually it's something like 26, 25, and then 24, and then it's, then it, then there's me, which is like 16, which is supposed to be like, which is an 8 year gap. I think, I think that's how it works. I, I, I know it's an 8 year gap, but I think I got their birthdays uh, spot on there because I'm turning 17, so I'm 16 right now. But yeah, I think it's an 8 year gap. Which means I got them right because it's 24, 25, 26. And that's how our birthdays work because I think they're, because I won't, re won't reveal their birthdays, but two of them uh, share a birthday in the same month. One's like, like early on. One's like, I think the, f I don't, I actually think I remember the, the date, but I'm actually not going to say the real one because it, uh, you know, I, I think I'll say the, the real one because I, I don't, they, I think I've got it right because I don't know the second one. But I think the first one's the third, and I think the other one's the 28th of, the, of that month. And then it goes a month over, and then it's something like, I don't know, the, the 19th or something. And then, then it's mine, which is the 20th, a month later. So, like, we have them all in order. So, yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. It's a, it's a little thing, but it was cool in my mind. <laughs> oh, Bill said. So, yeah.
that's going on, and I'm going to be happy because I'm going to be my my uh, I English. So my younger cousins on my dad's side, the people, they're the ones I usually talk to in these videos, saying that like, oh, don't watch this because you know you're younger and you, you shouldn't be hearing swearing from your older cousin. But because this video will be coming out soon enough, and I don't think they'll watch it because you know dead by dead, I told them that they shouldn't watch it. I bought them Ultimate Smash as a birthday present, and I also bought them, which I'm hoping is not what I think it is now. I bought them a Goku and Vegeta figure, but I read the, I fully read the description now, and it's a 21 centimeter candle, and I got scared because I don't think it's that, but because I, I think that could have just been an extra tag, but if it is, at least I got them Ultimate Smash, so I can't be, I can't be beating myself up to, uh, up so much, but they cost 35 each. And I, I, I think, I don't think they are, because, like, I'm, honestly, I think that, even if they are, I feel like they can just, like, leave them on, because they have, like, a giant shelf of, like, Lego and little, bit, little bits and bobs. And even if they are a candle, like, thing, then I think they'll still like it, because it's not going to be completely like an action figure, because they would have been actual, like, statues, anyways. So, I can't be beating myself too much, but I'm, I'm just going to feel stupid that I felt that, if it is true, I fell for it. Cause I, I knew it's I cause I know it's gonna be coming uh, soon enough. But anyways. Oh wait, wait. I need to change my perks. Uh we have them in the order I usually have them. We have that. Over one. Uh prove thyself. There it is. Spine chill is something I used to run when I first played the game. Uh not as much anymore. Uh da -da -da -da. No one left behind, no. Hmm. Leader. Uh, unhooking speeds. Mm. So if I'm correct, I think it's what I want is head. Do I have head on? Ooh, head on. I believe head on says active. Yeah, okay. I never get a chance to use head on, but I want to try it. So, head-on says, basically, uh, while head-on is active, performing a rush action, leaving the locker with head-on and killer standing there, then on the effective range, you will stun the killer for three seconds. I'm gonna do that. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm excited for the party, and I'm excited for this round. But, yeah, like, so something I'm gonna do definitely soon enough. Not yet, because I think I may have to actually buy a real mic. And I, I said, because I basically spend money like a madman. <laughs> and I, and people would be like, oh, I exaggerate. You must be exaggerating. I, f I bought four, uh, four t-shirts of merch. Like, four different ones. And then I bought, I bought new, uh, new Switch controllers, because my last ones broke. When I left inside the Switch, and when I dropped the Switch, the actual, like, black piece popped out of place. So we just kind of put the wiring back in there and just went like, okay, it's broken. And my blue one started drafting, and I, my original set, which are a major draft. So I bought a new set. So this is third set. And they're very cool because of like the see-through, and then they have like the actual wiring, and they have flashing green lights, and then they have like flashing green lights coming through the clear bit. And the buttons are red, green, blue, and yellow on both controllers. So it's sick as hell, and it came with a new controller piece. So, I'm- I'm happy. Like, obviously I shouldn't be happy that I keep breaking controllers, but like, I'm happy. Actually... I'll check after, at the end of the video. Also, I forgot to check the perks. I'm- I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm big dumb. Ah, well. It's happened, I can't check it now. <laughs> but, yeah, I- I spent a lot of money. I also- even though these were very cheap. I bought Akatsuki rings, like from the show Naruto, and I've been giving them out to my friends. Which is something I've actually really wanted to do to show them that, you know, thank you for... Even though I know I shouldn't have, it's usually a thing to say thank you for at least, like, sticking by my side. Through thick and thin, because, trust me, like, I'm not, I'm not mentioning a lot of this off, uh, on camera to, you know, when I'm a bit older and I have the strength to talk about these, because, like, Trust me, it's nothing too bad, but it's just like, it just kind of piled. Like, stuff has happened, and 
I've had, I've told my friends about it and they've helped me through it a lot. So I thank them every day for like sticking by my side and you know helping me. And it, it's a small thing, but it makes you feel good when you know that you have people that you can trust. So yeah, I that that was my little present. So a lot of them were like, oh, I'll, I call this ring. A couple of them didn't because they're like, I don't want the rings. So uh, yeah, but I've actually still got like six six or five rings left because. I know, because red was called, orange was, because it's all, like, different colors, so red was called, orange, blue, teal, and something else was called, so, I, yeah, I think it's five, and I said that I would take the last ring, whatever ring is left, I'll take it, because if it's purple, then I'll take purple, if it's white, it's white, I'll take white, if it's, uh, if it's pink, I'll take pink, I don't care what's left, because if you're the person g giving people an item, you should not. You shouldn't get to call what's first. So I was like, okay, I'll take whatever's left. So yeah. All right. I feel like we're gonna get Raccoon City, and I'm going to be screwed because I can. I seem to get like Omega screwed on these videos. Oh well. Okay. Actually, something I did buy because it, it like trust me, this cost me a lot because I'm I either I'm going to get this for my birthday, like request it or Christmas or I'll just buy it on my own time. I bought a GameCube original game. I bought Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. The the actual game condition is actually pretty damn good, but if you want to know how much it cost me, let's just cost say it didn't cost me over 200, but like it cost me big bucks. And I, like, because I really wanted a GameCube ever since I was younger. And I know people, oh, wait, wait here. Yeah. Like, trust me, like, I, I'm technically the era of the Wii. Or, like, a little bit behind it, but, like, I'm pretty much the era of the Wii. So, I had a Wii growing up, but ever since I saw a GameCube and saw games, like, there are four different Mario parties. There's Mario Kart Double Dash, which is sick as hell. There are... Oh, no. There are definitely a couple other games that went on there that look sick as hell. And that's what I mean. Like, I want the GameCube because it has so many good games. And since I kind of can't access my... my uh... Oh, my God. What are you doing, you dummy? Uh, since I kind of can't access my Wii U, which has my original Mario Party games... Because, trust me, Super Mario Party, cool game, but Mario Kart 8 is, like, the best to have. Because 10 was a team game, 9 was a team game, and whatever was on the 3DS was just kind of bad. I, I, I owned it, but it was kind of bad. Because you need multiple people with 3DSs, and I was the only one in my family. And I mean, like, between, like, all my cousins, I was the only one who had a 3DS. So, yeah, it was kind of bad. And the Super Mario Party is fine, but it says like 15 rounds. It's like, oh, it takes half an hour, but like, it doesn't take that long. It takes 10 minutes at the max, so it's not as good. But that's why I was like, oh, if I can get GameCube, I have Mario Party 7, 8, no, I have 7, 6, uh, 5, and 4. It's something like that. So you get a crazy amount of games. So I was like, okay, that's cool. Because, say, if I, I'm talking with my sister, and she's like, Oh, uh, like, what one do you want to play? Because I'm kind of getting sick of seven. I can just go Mario Party 6, man. The, 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 uh, the, what is it called? Uh, the graphics may be a little bit worse, but they're a lot different uh, mini games. So, that's why I wanted it. And honestly, it's cool. Trust me, it's sick as hell. Like, I don't care. I would, oh, oh, it's, shit. Oh, you saw that. My, my thingy went off, which means there's probably a totem around here somewhere. Nope. It's in the corn. It's in the corn. Yeah. Careful. It's a dull one, but it's points no matter what. It's a thousand blood points. No, don't hit me. If, I, if you hit me, I have to restart. I think they're a bit baby. Like they, if they get, if they down me, they're not that good because I'm a bad player, anyways. Like I'm, I'm only ranked 16. But like, 
If they down me, I'm I'm go I'm gonna be mad, but like I'm not gonna be too mad. Cause I I usually don't count an achievement if you kill me because whenever we play, I feel like I'm the first one to go down, even when I'm actually like really trying. And even on a good day I go down a lot. Damn it. I have to get out of here. We run a little bit. And then we walk. Is there a thingy in here? Okay. But, yeah. I've really wanted to get, um, like, GameCube, honestly. Sick as hell. Thousand Year Door was not my first game I wanted to play. Because I've played a Paper Mario game, I played... Oh, no. That's Blight, if I'm correct. Because I'm... Because how I remember is, I'm Dwight, so that means it's a B, so it's Blight. And he has the crowbar. The dashy crowbar. Which is kind of a thing that's annoying. But, yeah. Uh, um, I've, yeah, I've played original... Originally, I played Super Mario on the Wii. But it, it's okay, because it's cool. I, I like the game. I, I've almost beat it uh, when I originally had my Wii. I got to the final battle. Like, I got to the Luigi area, and I just choked. No, I beat the Luigi area. I was at the Mario area. I choked at the end, and I felt so bad because I could never do it because I never had enough healing items, and I think I was max level. Doesn't matter if I get the tone now. Unless it's no edge, it doesn't really matter. But, yeah. Uh, if, I, if I had... Uh, okay, I, th I got scared. If I had my choice, and I'm being 100% honest, it would have been the original Paper Mario, because I thought that game was way cooler, but that's for the N64. N64 is different to the GameCube. So, yeah. Honestly, I... Like, I like Thousand New Door, because it's cool, but... Paper Mario was the first one I saw with the Star Spirits, not the Crystal Stars. Crystal Stars is Thousand New Door. But... It's a cool Pip Mario, Mario game, and it's an RPG, which I thought was very cool, so I'm not going to complain too much. So, eh. I forgot to check the perks again, because I'm dumb. 32, um, let's do one more round, let's do one more round, because I, I, I'm kind of feeling fire today. Actually, I'll end this, and then I'll do another set of rounds, and I'll count as my video for Thursday, because then I can upload it early, early Thursday morning. Or, like, late evening, ooh. Ooh, that works. But, yeah. A lot of things have been going on behind the scenes. And I wanted to get stuff up, but I couldn't. I'm probably going to do... Well, I'm probably going to hold off on the DeviantArt stuff. Uh, because... I don't have much more I'm going to be doing. Because, like, I have, like, an old book, like, of drawings. But, like, they're nothing good. Like, they were, they were quick, like, five-minute drawings. So they're, like, half-assed. There's a Krillin that's good in there, but that's kind of it. Other than that, it's kind of bad. So, <sighs> I I do have an idea that I'm, I want to, like, flesh out, but I haven't, because I struggle with massive, like, problem of, like, actually sitting down and doing something. Like, I want to work out, and I've had the idea to work out, but I don't get motivation. And I only have a draw when I'm in school, or if I'm, like, full on board, I'm like, I don't want to watch YouTube, I don't want to play video games, then I go to drawing. And... As you know, and I will show, let me just go to full, so you can see this, what am I getting bored of here? Like, seriously, the demo, I've maxed out every character, and I feel like I'd still go back to play. Unrailed, I, I eventually want to buy the full game, because I, I think that'd be fun for a couple videos. I haven't even gotten all the shinies in this, I've got one thing, uh, a uh, shiny rata, R ratata, whatever it's called. I haven't even got all the moons in this. I played that on the... I need to go back and play that, but, like, I pretty much played all on the Xbox. I still need to beat all the levels in this. I have beaten all that, but I feel like I'd go back at it for a couple videos. Bought that, because I was, like, three years online, so I was like, okay. Uh, haven't even touched this game. I've touched, like, first, like, like 2% of the game. And then I have all these other ones, so, like... A lot of these are demos though, because that's a that's a demo, and I want to play. I want to get the real one, but I want to see if I want to if I would like it, but I haven't sat down and played it. But like, well, I actually hundred percent of that game. That's the only one I can say I hundred percent properly.
and I haven't even finished or got like five stars on Animal Crossing. I've, I've got so much things. Plus, they've, they're adding a DLC for this, so I might as well get that when it comes out. I know I need to play more of this. I'm, I'm definitely going to go back and play more of this, but I haven't had the time recently. And definitely with the barbecue coming up, I won't have time to do that. But yeah, I have a lot of things I need to do, and I haven't gotten a chance to do them yet. So stay tuned, and that's what I mean by like I won't be drawing much. But when I get back to drawing, I ha I actually do have an idea. Because I had a game I wanted to play with my friends. And it was kind of an idea off of the... The... Recreo. A vi one of the Recreo videos. That I definitely want to post on the channel. But I want to play it a couple times off with my friends. To see how they like it. And if they wanted to do it for recordings. Because it was just going to be something we did while we were bored in like the lunchroom. But I still need to fix some stuff. And I want to do... I'll eventually do some character art for it. But for right now, this is all I got. I don't know what else to say. A lot of things have been going on. A lot of things offline. I lost connection. <laughs> oh hey, next day started officially. And I mean like, it's not, it's, not, it's not too long. Like it's only been like, it's only just hit 12 now. So it's not too late. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and don't forget the bell notification to get notified on anything else I do. Hopefully, I'll do this with my cousins later, and I'll explain a little issue with that. But, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, discussion page, uh, the song, uh, the, the song I use for my intros is in the description with my pals. Thank y'all, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.